Did you guys see what happened in Toronto this weekend, though, with the uh, the alt right parade that they had up there? Mm. That happened. Yeah, I kind of remember this now. The yeah. but the Black Lives. Oh, shit, that must have gotten buried. That's right. There was like a big conflict. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What what happened there? Black Lives Matter. They were the they were the uh, the honored group of marginalized whatever the fuck for Toronto Pride this year. So they had to lead float. In the parade. And what they do? Oh, no. They had to sit and they sat down and made demands. Because they didn't do nothing. Because oh. blacks is gay too. And we need That's shit. So we going to sit here. Oh, we going to sit here until Seventh Son's accent totally just <laughs> falls apart. So Dude, they, that was now you're going into like a, a Texas thing. That, that's, that's, that's why I said it until it falls apart. Was, it fell apart. Pretty, pretty good Tennessee accent. But they um thing. yeah they 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 staged a sit in. They delay they delayed the parade an entire 25 minutes. And of course, of course, the uh, the Canadian media just was ape shit that they're fucking like. Their what? dong and scissoring fucking rainbow parade was delayed by like what, we want to see the floats. Did they go with? Like which, oh, which way did they signal on that? Oh, that you know, being gay, yeah, that but a little we're, bit of a bind, but yeah, yeah, like we're we're queer black people, and 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 trans blacks are marginalized, blah blah blah. Just and they made these demands, like they they want their, like guess, um, the gay cops had a float, and they want their like to never uh, to be gay. They don't ever want there to be gay police in the in the pride parade ever again. <laughs> the irony. Oh, well, I saw some shit. I didn't know that it was it was Toronto, but I saw Stop some. Stop the village people. Yeah. I saw some shit. I don't know what the fuck gay parade it was, where like the Toronto. black, like the black gays left because there was like police. Oh no, no! What it was in New York City, because of the Orlando attack, ah. they increased police presence at all like the gay pride shit, and the Black Lives Matter people like wouldn't like like, protested the fact that there was more police because, like, their thing was, like, for some of us, more police doesn't make us safer. Yeah. And it's like, okay, so, so. It's for some of you, okay. Yeah, yeah. we have, I have the, the list it's of It's not demands. even actually true. I mean, that's actually totally well, wrong. Well, that's just, that's, that's just that's a, actually 110% wrong. But yeah, you know what, just, I like, I like that they believe it because <laughs> we'll keep shooting each other, so. Yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah, basically, yeah, they're, they'll be in danger for of their loved ones getting arrested for the bad shit. I mean, whenever, I mean, they mean you know, that. whenever, whenever you get like one of these black activists that says, you know, I'm, I'm for like community control of policing. I mean, I'm fucking 110% with you. I, I think that white cops should not have to police black neighborhoods. These but, people, but, these people basically, they demanded more funding for their, like their booths and shit during the, of uh, course. During the pride, I, mean, I, thing. I feel like we got an opportunity here, guys. I mean, we need to extend an olive branch to the gay community and remind them that the alt right. We are the, the gay community. What are you talking about? We, we don't have branch. this kind of shit going on in our gay pride parades. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So Toronto Pride, whatever the fuck they're called, like they caved all the demands within twenty minutes of this sit-in. Of course they did. Of course but, they did. Yeah, but now, but now, like they're walking it all back. <laughs> so they're uh, like cle clever, clever Judy. I actually want to. I actually dearly love, like I really, really, really love narrative cl clashes like yeah. this, and I really love when one victim group makes it. Like I, I love that. I, everything about like Black Lives Matter staging a protest at Gay Pride is like really is awesome. I want. I want to know what the demands were, and I uh, want to see all the cucks. I'll read them. To all you like want. the. Uh, like the gay activists, like you know, falling all over themselves to. I just like the. Easy. I just like that it supports the meme that well, meme the reality that just blacks just ruin everything, even like even that like you 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 it's like you give an inch and they're just like they're just like just whooping and hollering just can't control themselves, and they can even ruin something as stupid as a pride. But they they want let's see they want. Commit to black queer youth continued space, including stage tents, funding, and logistical support. So they want Gibbs. It's always funding. One. Always, yeah. always funding. They, they, always everything funding. has they, to be funded. Yeah. They want anyway. self self determination for all community spaces, allowing community full control over hiring, content, and structure of their stages. So they want they want Gibbs, and they want total control over what the, what the Gibbs pays for. Uh, full and adequate funding for community stages, including logistical, technical, and so there's more funding for something else. Double funding for <laughs> Blockarama plus ASL interpretation and headliner funding. I don't know exactly what that means. 
This Excuse is Gibbs. Me. It's all fucking. Yeah, it's all I mean, how many people are when they say community? They're talking about like a, this is like a group. Yeah, this is like yeah. this is organized rent seeking by like a small yeah. group. But yeah, reinstate and make a commitment to increase community stages spaces, including the reinstatement of the South Asian stage. So that's indirectly funding again because they want more stuff to be open, more booths and tents and crap. A commitment to increase representation among pri- amongst Pride Toronto staff hiring, prioritizing black trans women, black queer people, indigenous folk, and others from vulnerable communities. Yeah, so they want blatant fucking rent seeking. Yeah, it's- more, they want jobs, jobs for black. A uh, commitment to more black and okay. A commitment to more black. Deaf and hearing ASL interpretation interpreters for the festival. So they want. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. So why would you need them specially for black people? I guess because of the abonics. I don't know. Because they need to have. They have different. Jet, their gestures are much more energetic. <laughs> like, um, the, have you ever seen that guy in the South Africa where he was just like is a different sign language? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, how does that work? Like, seriously, how does that fucking work? It's just honestly, I don't know that they're necessarily saying they're for black people. They're just saying they want. They want them to be. It's a. It's a job. Yeah. And they think that the person in that job should be black. That's what there's they're a, doing. I gotta right. find the video and post it in the links. But there, there's, there was some like kill the boa speech going on when they had a a, a, a signer, a black sign, and he was just. You could tell he was just making shit up. Like when they said something about guns, he just made like the Rambo shooting thing with his hands. <laughs> <laughs> it was fucking hysterical. Like, you could tell it was like I would have to find that. But it was really good. That's the first thing that brought to mind. Uh, okay. So Two That's more demands. This is the big ones. The removal of police floats, booths, and all pride marches, parades, community spaces. <laughs> so no cops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This no is, gay this cops. Is similar. Something, yeah. something similar happened to... Um, well, in this case, they weren't protesting an actual police float. They were protesting police there as police. But yeah. And the last one was they want to have a public town hall organized in conjunction with groups from marginalized communities, including but not limited to Black Lives Matter Toronto, Blackness Yes, and Black Queer Youth to be held six months from today. Pride Toronto will present an update and action plan on the aforementioned demands. So I'm going to make up. A, I'm just going to make up a new group of people and start rent seeking. I mean, that's for the you know that's the trend. I'm just going to yeah. make up the next group of people. And we should try them. to recruit yeah. some like alt right people of color and just create something with them, like so that it's our people. But you know, because basically, if you're white, you can't really write rent seek for anything anymore. But if we can get some like, some like uh, yeah, you know, uh, Travis Schwartz's to work for us, yeah, I, I mean, we could do transhuman humanism pretty easily. There's like, I mean, this is so classic though, because this, if you remember, like the Mizzou demands, yes, that's it was what all I was the thinking. same kind of shit. It's like fund this, same fund that, stuff. put put blacks on the staff here, have more jobs for this, have more jobs for that, and, and you know, I don't know whatever it turned out with that, but my guess is that just as Mizzou said yes to everything, they yeah. also then, like a year later, probably had to walk back from a lot of yeah. it. Because the thing is, particularly in a politicized environment like a university, uh, you can't just like give jobs because right. somebody's in that job and that person has like been in that job for years and they've got connections, you know, they've got friends and they've got like there's a whole politics to jobs yeah. at a place like a university. Yeah. So you can't just be like Gibbs jobs and like then they just Gibbs them. There's, you know, it's it's. It's really. I mean, I guess they could literally make up positions and give them to them. I mean, that's what they had to yeah. do with women in Keck. Well, I think that's you what know, I, I, to, I think like, Michelle Obama. I, th- positions. I think Michelle Obama had a made up made up job at some yeah. big hospital out there in Chicago before because like yeah. she was getting like three hundred plus k a year, and they never. Yeah, she was getting like six figures for a completely made up job. That yeah, and they exist. never they never replaced her when she left. So it was just total, yeah. just complete yeah. black rinsing. But the thing about like these demands and these these because uh, you know you've got a bunch of you got a bunch of blacks in front of you demanding. So like the worst thing you can do is argue with them. It's like you just got to be like okay, okay, because they're just going to start breaking things, and they've been and we've trained them all this time to expect to be given into. So it's like this is kind of how it's going to go. Hopefully, always goes like. People like this are going to give in to them and then hopefully walk it back later. Because I mean, well, actually, no, I well, shouldn't even say I that. Mean, like, let let them hand let them hand the keys of Toronto I don't Pride over to the players. That would be funny. That. I don't I'm care thinking of, if that whole fucking thing collapses into a. Pile yeah, I mean, I'm, I was thinking insane. more of yeah, I was thinking more of the colleges you were talking about. Like that would be a shame oh, yeah. if no, you gave. I don't care them about them either. Yeah. I hope they do it. Give give. I want I want I want these institutions 
to give them everything that they want. Like, literally, when the Black Lives Matter people come and give a list of demands to, like, Toronto Pride or the University of Missouri, right. I hope that those organizations give them everything they want to the letter. Because I will sit back and I'll fucking make popcorn and laugh as I watch <laughs> it all go down in flames. Funny. 